Hey guys, Max Media Girl here. Um, so I had a friend that mentioned to me that she really liked sea turtles. So I got this idea and we're going to give it a go. Um, this is a 14 by 14 canvas and I sprayed it with the uh, Rust-Oleum paint and primer. This is gold metallic. Uh, so the first thing I'm going to do is with just some regular acrylic paint. I'm going to paint a couple sea turtles on here. Um, although she has four children, so I've been kind of toying with maybe painting more, but I think I'm going to stick with two. And I've never really painted on top of this Rust-Oleum, so we'll see how it goes. Um, and for anyone who doesn't know, with the sea turtles, I pretty much just do a large circle for the bottom. Then I point the end a little bit, that would be the tail. And then I add a little diamond up here for the head. I keep it pretty simple. <laughs> and then the um, fins or arms here, the ones at the front are real big. Anyone seen sea turtles? And then I just add some little legs at the back here. And that's really it. Keep it simple. So it is, the paint is not adhering to the um, gold as it would normally, so that's okay. I'll just um, add a second layer of paint. Or maybe I'll just make it a little bit thicker. This is all an experiment. I really hope that this plan works. I think it will. There we go. That's better. Okay, we'll go ahead and we'll add a second one. We'll just do it right here. I'm going to make this one a little bit bigger. So maybe this is her husband and that's her. <laughs> Not saying her husband is big or anything. He's just bigger than her. <laughs> Anyways. Oh, okay, so we've got the body, then we add the little tail, and then the little diamond for the head. And then we'll add the arms. And then the little back legs. There we go. All right, I'm gonna set this aside. While this is drying, I'm going to mix me up some resin. Okay, we're gonna be using the Stone Coat Countertops uh, Art Coat, which comes in a part B, part A and part B. And we're gonna mix equal amounts. All right, so we have mixed up our clear resin here, and now we're going to mix up our colors. So we're using the Ocean Blue Metallic Mica Powder, Tropical Turquoise Metallic Mica Powder, Blue Earth Metallic Mica Powder, and then we're using the white base tint, the blue base tint, and the black base tint. I am also going to leave a little bit of clear because I don't, because I want to use some of the clear. Okay, so here we go. And for anyone who is worried, I have ensured that my turtles are completely dry. One thing I am going to do real quick is just spray the back of this canvas with some water just to make sure that it is nice and tightened up. And that will help, especially with resin. 
so that the resin doesn't make it sag. All right, so over our turtles here, we're gonna start off by dumping some clear. And we'll go some over here. Okay. All right, so let's start with our mica powders. So this one is the Earth Blue. It's just a light blue. I got that a little closer to the turtles than I wanted. <laughs> and then we have, this is the Ocean Blue. So this is a darker blue. And I'm not super worried. If it a little bit goes over the turtles, I'm okay with that. <laughs> it's not a big deal. The point is I just definitely want them visible. All right, and then this one is the, uh, I, the tropical turquoise. Which this painting is for Catherine is her name, and I know for a fact that she loves this color. All right. And then we have some of the blue base coat. A little bit of the white base coat. And then the black. I'm not going to go too crazy with the black. I'm going to kind of keep it a little more towards the edges. Okay, there we go. At this point, we're gonna heat this with our heat gun, which will make it more fluid and also move it around a bit. All right, so far so good. I am gonna help it along on the edges here. And I did, I think I'm going to just thin it out <laughs> over those turtles there. Once again, right, this is an experiment. So we'll, we'll see how it comes out. I don't want them like, I don't want it to be this weird open spot there either. So I think I'm going to go in here with a little bit of this, uh, the earth blue, which is pretty light. And also a little bit of the white. And then I'm going to add some more black around here. Now I'm going to hit it with the heat gun again. There we go. I think I'm going to be happier with that. Okay. Much better. All 
Okay, start over here. So this is the bottom of the painting. As you can see, a bit darker. Um, I did want the gold to show through, not on the whole thing, but in certain parts, and I definitely think that I got that. We have some nice lacing with the white there. You can see that the uh, turtles are covered a little bit, but not too much, so you can still definitely clearly see them. Um, and then, yeah, before there was kind of like just this random gold spot there, now I think it blends better. So there you have it. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Please do not forget to subscribe, and we'll see you next time.